So in the first video, we went over the uh, verbal instructions. In the second video, we looked at finding and using a theme. And in the third video, we worked to find the boundaries of what we needed to do. Okay, so again, the theme is connection, unity, and diversity. That's what I see it for me. Maybe you have a different theme, a different set of ideas that connect everything together. But that's what works for me. If you want to steal it, go ahead. It doesn't belong to me. These words do not belong to me. They're to be used by everyone. If you want to use the theme, use it. Please, please. I don't mind. Um, and trust me, it won't be boring because you guys are exciting. So I start to think about what is the theme of my life? What ideas connect everything together? Connection, unity, and diversity. Okay. Well, this definitely talks about unity. And these are two very different people, the Egyptians and the Israelis. Now, I happen to know this as a, an adult and a historian. And they have very different perspectives. And I know that the we can be unified in huge disasters, but we all have very different reactions to them. So the baby is happy, hungry, and curious while all this is going on. This is a baby that is not aware of connection, unity, and diversity. The connections, so maybe I start to think the connections I made as a baby were few. Cry? Uh, no, hungry? <laughs> hungry? Cry. Wet? Cry. <laughs> Uncomfortable? <laughs> Cry. Uh, the world was, the world was my body and my needs, my needs, nothing else. So let's count my words. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. If my second language is English, then I probably want to go with about 25 words, okay? With about 25 words. Tools, spelling, does it do a word count? It does not. So I'll just have to count them from here on. So let's, let's look for, again, connection, unity, and diversity on the next slide. Connection, unity, diversity. So I was making connections to the world, uh, to the insects, to other people and stories, to art, and to learning being fun. And I also learned that these nuns weren't about me, they were about the school. Okay, so we, I was, I was unit, there was unity in my life because I saw all of these nuns as against my learning and not helping me um, get curious about the world and participate in it. So, hmm, how can I talk about connection, unity, and diversity? My time before schooling was exciting making connections all the time with the natural world and the spoken and written word. The nuns at my Catholic school, I'm capitalizing Catholic because it's a specific religion, um, nuns at my Catholic school saw school as more important than learning. It would impact me the rest of my life. That's probably about right. It's probably more than 30, 25 words. So if I look at this, it's probably uh, a good enough. And since I'm not really gonna talk very long about this slide, I'm gonna just keep you know, go in here. I'm going to do two, maybe three more. So again, I'm looking for connection, the theme of connection, unity, and diversity. 
Uh, my family, however, loved to connect to a wide variety of things. Baseball, swim, parks, the zoo, and reading and writing together became almost religious acts. Um, <laughs> funny though, I could easily get <laughs> bribed by ice cream and bubbles. Now the second part isn't true, but it just sounds awesome. I could get bribed by ice cream and bubbles. I don't know why, but that makes me laugh, so I kept it in. How does that comparing to the others? Okay, I'm getting a little bit too long. Okay, because this one's a little longer. This one's a little shorter, so I want to try to stick to two lines on the next one. Okay, let's see. Connection, unity, diversity. We'd go many places to experience life. Movies, TV, movies, TV, and um, music allowed us to bond as a family. Since like, the other two, since four was a little long and three was a little long, I'm going to try to go short uh, where I can't. Okay. Then I come up here. This will be the last one I'll do. Um, and then I'll do the work offline and show you the result. Um, this is a depiction of the healthy, happy things happening in my community. Again, connection, unity, diversity. Connection, unity, diversity. Connection, unity, diversity. Um, as I grew older, I noticed many things about my community. We are a, and I'm just going to use what I wrote here. And since I, I totally want to be lazy, I'm going to take that. Uh, command or control C, come over here, command and control V. Uh oh, it's all gone. I need to change the text to black. And what size is this? This is 11. Let's make this 11. Okay. And we, Albuquerque is, no, New Mexico is a gun toting, always changing. Never not being New Mexico place. <laughs> I think social change, huge social change will start from here and spread throughout the planet. That's pretty cool to say. So I'm going to stick with that. That's more than 25 words. But if I practice, I'll be able to do that faster. Um, and... Yeah, eh, one more. What's it going to hurt? Okay, oops. I, I do want that to stay similar, so I'll make that aerial too. I, it seems silly to you guys, but it really does matter. Your brain will pick it up better if it's all consistent. Um, and lastly, because I like the number seven, have you noticed? Um, so, again, oops come down a little bit. Uh oh, that is not there. I forgot what the theme was. So I connect. I add here. Boom. What is the theme of my life? What ideas connect everything together? What's connection, unity and diversity? Um, as I grew up, my um, interests became my own. Um, I was in increasingly interested in both the beauty and brutality of everyday experience. And I knew my family was luckier than most because we didn't see the bru brutal world 
in our own home. I was very, very lucky. So the rest of this I'm gonna continue offline and then the next I will kind of show you how I would set up um, the instructions for, um, um, what's it called, uh, Screencastify or Flipgrid. We'll go from there.